Hey guys, Sandy here. Welcome back to my channel. Today is the last day of Christie's 30 days of sketches and today's sketch is this one right here. Now it definitely has a Christmas theme. I am not going to be doing that um, and I'm not even using a photo that size. I'm actually using the uh, contract for my Disneyland annual pass, which I'm not going to open up to show you. It's got all kinds of personal information in there. So there is that. I'm going to do that. And instead of my title here, I'm imagining the title is going to be over here. And we're going to turn this into a pocket page somehow. So let's see what I can do. All right, you guys. So I have this stripey bit of paper and this is a a photo play paper and of course I you know put my adhesive down on it like I would any piece of paper that I'm getting ready to place across the bottom of my layout but then I neglect it to realize that this is going to be a pocket so I had to put adhesive around the outside of the three edges instead of uh, like you know what I've seen so I had this idea to put that Mickey uh, kind of pants <laughs> looking paper over here on the edge. And ultimately it, it never makes it onto the layout. It's just awkward and weird and it doesn't happen. So I'm trying to kind of represent these circles and the Santa that is across the page. So I'm going to go ahead and place these rainbow uh, cameras underneath. And I'm just trying to figure out like where the, what it's going to look like and where the paper is. So I decide that the paper is going to cover up way, way too much of the cameras and I want the cameras to be seen. So I decide to uh, put them down on the striped paper. And then I've done this before uh, with another uh, layout where I went and pulled stickers that matched the color that was on the page. So I'm doing that one more time. Um, I don't think that this is something that I do so much in my albums that you're just going to see it everywhere and you're going to be like, wow, Chick likes rainbows. <laughs> um, actually, you know what? You might see rainbows in my album a lot, and you might think, whoa, Chick likes rainbows. That's okay. I'm okay with it. Anyway, what I'm getting to is I need to get all of these pieces down to coordinate with each color of the camera. Now, this one was a basically a white sticker, and I didn't have enough red, so I went ahead and just used my ink to ink that bad boy up. Now, I am going to uh, overlap these bad boys, and I'm just going to try to kind of kind of keep them in line um, as I'm overlapping them and then you know I'm not being careful and I peel up things so I just have to be careful when I put them back down onto the page so <laughs> now we go ahead and we get these down and I'm making sure that they overlap I just don't want the pieces um, of striped paper peeking through. I want this to be a long line of stickers. And since I peeled off so much of that one, we had to add a little bit more adhesive. Now I am overlapping everything and not really like worried about it. Uh, and then I decide that I really de need it to figure out what the heck was going over here under in this black one. Um, so I grabbed this black and white pillow one and it says home. Um, and you know, that is a thing that a lot of uh, Disney fans call Disney as home. So I figured it was appropriate. Now, even though this is Disneyland, um, we can, we can still call it home. So I'm going to go ahead and put the cameras across there so that it kind of has those colors, uh, running down from the camera. Um, and then I have these big old gemstones. And at first my plan was to, um, put it all the way across. Uh, and then I decided not to do that. Um, I guess I decided not to do it whatever else I was doing later. So I trimmed off a little bit of the striped paper that I had left. And I'm going to put it over here in the upper left hand corner because there is embellishment over there. Um, so I went ahead and placed that there. And then I'm trying to figure out what the heck I'm doing with this Mickey thing. And then I'm like, oh... I just covered up all of that prettiness. I don't I don't want to do this. Like I don't want to cover that up. Um, I have these huge gold letters from my mind's eye. Um, and it's AP for annual pass. 
Um, so now I'm just trying to figure out what the heck I'm doing. Because I am kind of deviating from the sketch a whole lot, um, I'm trying to just make the page work for me. Um, but I'm still trying to give like a nod to the sketch. So I still have embellishment in the upper left hand corner. I have something going across the center of the page with the cameras and the the uh, stickers and the rhinestones. And then I have a cluster uh, down here on the bottom where the AP is. So I'm trying to make that kind of like at least that nod to the sketch, uh, even though it's not a whole heck of a lot like the sketch. And you guys, that's okay. Like it's, it's completely fine. Um, I mean, we're on what day 59 and I haven't gone completely rogue on a sketch yet. Um, I do imagine that it, it will come, it will happen. Uh, but right now it has not. So I am going to go ahead and use a black piece of paper there. And I decided to use the black piece of paper because I thought I was bringing in that Mickey, uh, piece over here. Uh, the Mickey piece never happens, so I just have the pop of black, and I'm okay with it. Now I'm going to go ahead and flip through the sticker book some more and um, find some of these little heart banners. So I think these are actually like tick off things, uh, like check off um, that you put in your planner, um, but I'm just using them here as. Um, banners as decoration. So I go ahead and overlap another uh, label sticker there and then I decide to put one of those big honkin' gemstones up there as well just to give me the shine. Um, and then since I have the black up there, I decide that I need to add a little bit more black down here. So I have these small rhinestone uh, little thingies and I just go ahead and place that down underneath of the cameras. Um, that way it's giving me that little pop of black that I feel like I need. And I've also decided to fold my uh, receipt for the annual pass in half instead of having it um, as a full 8.5 by 11 sheet and being able to read it. So if you were interested in reading it and like pulling it out, uh, you would just have to like reach into the pocket and do that. So now I'm trying to figure out how to make this cluster down here. Um, and nothing, nothing is working. Nothing is working where I'm adding more paper to it. I don't like it. I feel like it's competing with these beautiful photos that I have going on across the top of the, the top of the stripey bits. And I don't like it. Uh, so I decide to just pop down those letters straight onto the stripey paper and I'm going to be happy with it. But now I feel like the page is a little bit naked so something has to um, go up here on the yellow part. And I'm going to go ahead and do that. Now, I also was thinking about bringing in these wooden hearts, but I really struggled with the wooden hearts and I'm not exactly sure what it is. They are, they're kind of a funky shape. Um, they're just kind of a little bit of a funky shape and I struggled with them. Um, but I did find this gold bow uh, down at the bottom of my kit and I was like oh I should just put that down there. I also have this silver and white paper um, and I decided to layer that up here uh, behind the annual pass. That way I'm covering up some of that yellow um, and I'm getting a little bit more sparkle and shine and I'm just filling up kind of that big empty expansive space right there. Um, sometimes I'm a fan of lots of white space, uh, but in this, this case, I just felt like I needed to have more. So I go ahead and place, uh, a little bit of that blue right there as well. And I think that blue is a good match for the blue camera. So I'm feeling like, I'm feeling like it's okay. Um, and then on the other side of that, uh, blue paper, there was a speech bubble with words and one of them was yay. So I went ahead and uh, punched that bad boy out. So my title is now yay AP. Um, and I'm just going to adhere that on there. And I'm just, you know, I'm trying out my chipboard. I'm like, do I want the little, like the sunbursty things or do I want stars? And ultimately I go with the sunbursty things. Um, and what that is going to do is just give me um, something extra to embellish with. So 
I've already got the rhinestones. I've already got the sparkly bits. I've already got the shiny things. Now I'm going for something that's going to give me a little lift um, off of my page and just a little bit of a different texture because it has this smooth texture on it. And I keep like moving things around, trying to figure out what I'm going to do. Um, I am using some Nouveau Deluxe Adhesive to adhere this chipboard uh, down to the page. Um, and then I decide that I'm going to have them kind of even go off the page. So I cut one of the chipboard pieces down and place it right there. And then I'm going to uh, do the same thing down uh, here at the bottom. Now I was thinking about um, where I wanted these pieces to go. Um, so I went ahead and placed some over here by the similar colors. Um, and then down here at the bottom, um, I felt like this little orange piece looked better here. I know that it's almost directly across from the cut orange piece on the top, but I just felt like it it weighed better there. Like it just, it held more space on the page there. It just made more sense and it felt better. Um, and as you guys know, I'm all about how my pages make me feel. So I'm unsure if I'm finished with this. So I keep touching it um, and pressing things down just to make sure that they stay. Um, and now I'm like, okay, I need to add on my Mickey. Um, I wanted to have the gemstone Mickey because I had all the gemstones on the cameras. There it is, guys. Thank you so much for joining me uh, for this uh, sketch. I do believe this is the last day of 30 Days of Sketches. Uh, it has been a super fun time. But if you are still excited for the sketchy goodness, that is going to continue with 100 sketchy videos all the way through May 10th. Make sure you join the Scrapping Reflections Facebook group. You'll have access to the sketches. Thanks again, guys, and I will see you again real soon for another video.